Gilded Arrow got nerfed, and I feel like the Gilded Arrow nerf hurt it more than like the power nerfs hurt the other ones. I feel like minus five off of it was pretty, pretty big for it. So like y'all. Yeah. He did it. Predecessor honestly felt like a lot like early smite Just in terms of like The game was fun and they had a good baseline and you know, there's like 16 characters or whatever So like if you want like for like each role only has a couple of characters This wasn't like a lot of variety, you know, but like that's Part of the beginning of MOBAs is that there's just not a lot of characters, you know Double kill which is fine, as long as you can consistently build on it pretty quickly, you know, if you get a pretty good schedule going out. I don't know how many characters there were in Paragon before it went under. But presumably they could get out those characters pretty quick. And then it would be after that is when I would start to get concerned. Paragon had like 25 plus. Thirty, thirty-five. Okay. See, so like they could pump those out pretty quick. They could have a nice pace on those, which would keep the game fresh, have nice consistent updates for a little bit, you know. Enemy missing. That axe actually just killed his sub -back, I think. Oh my goodness, so close. Force him to use a shell. That oh, oh that block definitely killed him. The Miss Sylvanas pluck was actually a bait to get the soul back to pluck to kill him. Ah! Your middle tower is under attack. Never Ribbit. let your guard down. All a part of the plan, dude. Now you got smite on the brain, but Bisha smite on the brain, dude. It's all up in your limbic system. Freedom! You it's a good old fashioned bait off and duo. No, that's a different thing. Oh, no, 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 no. It's just not mean what you think it means. You got the beach hydration formula this weekend. I like anything peach flavored, to be honest. I like the peach. Yeah, I didn't get an opportunity, Big O, to play a lot of roles in Predecessor. I only played mid and ADC. Uh, and one of the biggest problems with Pred, in fact, there was really only two. No, there was three major problems with the game. Uh, and one of them was the fact that it was horrendously balanced uh, at the time. Um, mages were just Thanks. not good. <laughs> just not good. Um, 
So I played, I played mid and ADC. And I was like, I was like doing fine. I was going like, I was going like eight and one. And I was like, I mean, I'm doing good, but I wasn't like able to carry the game. And then I played ADC one game and I went like 30 and zero. And I was like, ah, okay. So we still got some balancing work to do here. Ah, I see you now. <laughs> that was one of the, the major issues. To be fair, I mean, the game's in beta and they're trying to work it all out, but my, my, I was like, oh, oh, gotta work on the physical damage here. Gotta tone that down. I played Kabrakin and Overprime, yeah, pretty much. I played a support. Enemy missing middle. How did the tier one item down. nurse feel? Uh, I, the games have been decent today. They. A trend that I think I'm noticing with these patches. And we'll see if it holds true for the current game that we're in, but the patches are starting to slow the pace of the game okay. down in the early game. Um it seems to be toning it down. Not that you can't snowball, but it does seem to be making it harder to snowball, which is good. But, and I couldn't tell you why, but there still seems to be this almost like artificial wall at around the like, 15 to maybe 20 minute marker where it seems like a team just starts to run away with it and like I guess you could make the argument that well games are supposed to be like 25 minutes long is what they want but like I just it still just feels like it feels like the game is really 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 even and then it's just Enemy immediately mission. over. If that makes sense. Like it is feeling more even throughout the early game. And I'm feeling like there's less of like a steady decline of snowball, but it still does feel like we woo, we woo. Okay, well, I guess I'm not going now. <laughs> well, now you made me look silly. <laughs> I wanted to go for it so bad. Yeah, it just it seems like it seems like even though the games are getting, I would say, more even earlier. Like it's eight minutes right now, we're pretty dang even. But there just there seems to be like this moment. It doesn't even necessarily have to be like a bad it doesn't even have to be like this tremendous big occasion like oh we five man wiped and lost the fire that. giant like oh that happened it's just like it's, i don't know on it's like way. all of a sudden one team just starts to like gas up. retreat in general obviously there's always going to be exceptions uh to those rules and stuff but that's just kind of the vibe that i've been getting slowly slowly patch by patch repairing a little repairing a little repairing a little which is good um, enemy missing middle but there still seems to be this just this Thanks. moment in time where the game is close and then the game is over you know it doesn't it doesn't feel like there's a lot of comeback potential in the late game because it feels like okay the game is close the game is close the game is close the game is over you know, it's like once you get that, that, that it's uh, it's like that first swing. Once you get that first swing, it doesn't really feel like there's a way to uh, to work your way back in. The fire has arrived. Okay, we woo. 
Thank you. So cool. <laughs> Enemy spotted. On my way. Moving in the right direction, at least. Sure. I will. I will caveat that it, it would have been basically impossible to move in the wrong direction. <laughs> so we should caveat. <laughs> Um, but sure. Follow me. <laughs> it, it, it basically, the games pretty much could not have gotten any any faster than they were. It was uh, we were we were really gas pedaling in Smite. There has not been a lot of metas in Smite that were faster than five minutes. You know, there have been a couple, and I've been around for them. There haven't been a lot of them. Very few indeed. Season four has entered the chat. Your right tower is under attack. Do you want to buy a red pot? You can get a level one. Oh, Another oh, Patriot oh, has fallen. oh, okay, oh, this is awkward. Chances they go for the gold fury, like pretty decently high. Your middle tower Ooh, is under there. attack. Place a ward for telephone. Don't drop. beads. Woo! Gotta go. I'm around. There's zone, they can't come this way. Your right tower I'm a leaf. Enemy spotted. Alright. Danza has one of the best salts in the game right in terms of fun. I agree. From a pure fun standpoint. Hopping in a rocket ship and chasing down the enemy. That's good gameplay. You know? That's good stuff. Really, really want them. But imagine backing with this much farm. Uh, me. Hashtag 12 more ways. <laughs> Ribbiting. Ribbiting. Bring back adventures. Ah. Uh, I feel like at some point they hinted at the fact that they were gonna bring back adventures But Honestly As much fun as adventures were and I'm not saying they weren't fun because they were fun uh, That would have been something to do in like November December of last year when we had a bajillion people playing Smite and not necessarily right now when we've got literally like 50% less people playing. You know? Can't, uh, can't afford to split up those queues. Gotta, gotta keep that player base queue nice and tight. On my way. Nice and tight. I'll take middle lane. A gift. Oh, Holy shit! You're on fire! An ally has been slain. Hmm. Two down, baby. An enemy has been slain. Your middle tower has been destroyed. Hey. 
Oh, they didn't go for gold. I'm gonna take a gander and fire up. It is flashing. Come on, Pyro, you can do it. Pave the way, spawn right back into it. There you go. Wow, great ball. I'm chasing him down with you. This is a good direction, isn't it? An enemy has been slain. Alright. <laughs> Your right tower is under attack. Cool. Return to the base. That'll do. Our farm, comrade. Start to work on that Deathbringer, and I guess I'll go back to duo five minutes later. I guess, yes. Danza's two is really good at Zoda. Really good at it. Okay. Astounding. Morgan, known as La Bay. I'm going for jumping. There she is. Morgan La Bay. Get him, boys. <laughs> so sometimes, sometimes you just say to yourself, "Yeah, I'm going for it." <laughs> America, to the rest. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I am everywhere. <laughs> Your team has destroyed a middle enemy tower. I needed a bag for my Deathbringer anyway, you know. Hold down the W. Hold on. Do you think I can just get away with this as my pen? 7, 14, 21, 28. For justice. And that's 28 removal. Defend. Get the ten Place the ward for teleport. Do some quick math here. <laughs> One, two, three, 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 three. down to 72 protection, which then goes down to... You're the rock between the hard brother. space. 65 protection. <laughs> Penetration rate of about 35. Not too shabby. Quick math. I need a sign over my head that says, Call me a submarine because I be diving. <laughs> An enemy has been slain. Hold a diver. Be careful. Okay. 
that fire? Keep your senses sharp. May your spirit go on free. Enemies in left lane. It will be an honor to wield this. Attack middle lane. Hmm? Attack middle lane. Enemy missing left. <laughs> Dominant right To the rescue. We'll see. An ally has been slain. Guess I'm shoving mad. You're right, Phoenix is under attack. No problem. Oh well, dude, I have the exact same idea. That's okay. I believe Wind Demon from Morpet. I think Wind Demon is one of the worst items in the game. You're on fire. I genuinely think it is horrible. I've looked at the stats and you cannot convince me that it's a good item. <laughs> you cannot. Okay. I will die on this my hill. Going with the Atalantas. Can I explain? It doesn't have good stats. It doesn't. It has like, it gives you like eight power and like half an attack speed. It's just, it's not good. Ah, it's not good. Weapon. <laughs> it costs you like, you have to like take out a mortgage. Place a ward for teleport. And you get a shed, you know? I think Atalanta's in general is underrated. I think a Kins would have worked in this last slot. I think an Atalanta's worked in this last slot. And I think a Dominant works in this last slot. An enemy has been slain. Two down, baby. Be in the game. We should probably attack the Titan. We should probably attack the, yep. So, yep, just hit it. Why is it chasing your kitty cat? <laughs> Why is it chasing your kitty cat? <laughs> Did I feel that wall again this game where our team just ran away with it? Yes. It was a little bit later that game, but if you noticed, there was not a single fire giant that happened that game. It came later in the match that ended up being a decently long match. Was it like, what, 30 minutes? How long was that game?
Where do I even tell how long my game was? Isn't it over here somewhere? No, nope, it was only 24 minutes. Wow, that was not even... It was actually exactly 25 minutes, so it was actually right in the range. But... There's a point in the game where you just... I think it's be... I think the problem is death timers. I think the problem is death timers. If I had to put my tongue on it, I would say death timers are way too long, way too early. They hit a point where... It was at probably the 22 minute marker where we just kind of killed them all and then walked down and ended the game. We didn't like do the smite objective thing. We, we never really fought over objectives. We never really, we just kind of AFK farmed for 20 minutes and then had one team fight and then walked down to kill the Titan. <laughs> Thank you for supporting the Twitchiest community. If you'd like to see more videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel and always hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss any of the upcoming videos. Thank you for all your support and have a twitching day, y'all.